Amber is a 75-year-old that lives in upstate New York. Based on her conditions and changes, she is eligible for remote patient monitoring. Patient Outreach Specialist Michael creates an outreach journey leveraging the Microsoft Cloud for Healthcare Patient Outreach Solution. With a user-friendly interface, he is easily able to create a full onboarding and ongoing journey that systematically creates tasks, activities, and drives workflow to support the remote patient monitoring program. Amber receives the invite based on her primary method of contact and clicks the link to enroll in the program. Health Coach Molly. Molly is tasked with the tracking and interacting with patients enrolled in the remote patient monitoring program to ensure that they are able to set up their devices as well as being alerted with any exacerbations. Molly views a list of patients assigned to her by the priority as well as the patient notification section to view any outstanding task. Liberating the patient assistant, she can stay on top of each task she needs to adhere to. In the view, she has a prioritized list of patients by risk, which is based on patient demographics, conditions, and outstanding tasks associated to the patient. In the patient view, Molly can view a consist flow on what needs to be done for the patient. She can also view outstanding tasks in the patient notification section she must perform for the patient. First, she sees that she must register a device to the patient. Liberating the Microsoft Cloud for Healthcare end-to-end -end remote patient monitoring solution, Molly can easily register and allocate the appropriate device to the patient. Also utilizing the Patient Services Center solution with Microsoft Cloud for Healthcare, she can follow a script in order to perform an outstanding care assessment with the patient. After performing the necessary task, the health coach progresses the patient to the next phase of the care for the nurse care manager and closes out all outstanding tasks. Through the Microsoft Cloud for Healthcare Management solution, Cami, the care manager, also has a dashboard view of patients that had had recent exacerbations, as well as patients that had overdue care plan activities through the patient's assistant. He can also is able to state on top of all posts, notes, and activities for this patient through the timeline. He sees Amber, is part of this group, and he has a high alert exacerbation for her remote patient monitoring device through thresholds that has been set for the device by the clinical staff.
upon opening Amber's patient's view, he has the ability to view patient notifications specific to the patient as well as his expertise of care. After reviewing the task, he sees that he needs to make some updates to the patient's care plan as well as contact the patient and her physician about the recent exacerbation. Before updating the care plan, Kemi wants to review the patient's recent appointments, conditions, assessments, and medications. To dive a bit deeper, who goes into the timeline to get a sequential view of these clinical occurrences in order to uncover trends to make the appropriate updates to the care plan. Cami then browses to the care plan portion where he is able to get a concise view of all the care plans the patient has. He can view the current problems that drive the activities and tasks associated with the care plan. Based on the assessment and clinical occurrences, Cami makes and updates the care plan problems which updates the associated tasks through a workflow. After making the update, Cami ensures that patient is notified but also sees he must review with the patient's physician. Directly through Microsoft Teams, the patient is able to contact the physician to set up time to review the care plan prior to addressing to the next phase of the patient process. A few months after being contacted by her care manager and physician, Amber is experiencing some chest pains that has alarmed her. Her physician notified her that she can perform an on-demand virtual visit whenever she feels she needs immediate help. Throughout the Microsoft Cloud for Healthcare virtual visit solution, she is able to directly book a virtual visit through the patient access portal. She first selects what type of visit she needs, next she reviews her information to ensure that it is correct. Next, she selects her appropriate insurance for the visit. Lastly, she consents to the visit and enters the queue, which takes her directly to the virtual visit with Microsoft Teams. Thank <laughs> you. 